The first object we're going to make, we're going to make using the additive method. So we're going to create this object right here using an additive method. Now there's lots of ways to do additive. I'm going to show you one way. The biggest thing is you start off with one shape and we're going to add off of it. So what I'll do is I'll put this up, um, put this over here on the side so we can see this um, here. So make this shape here. Well, let me get it any smaller. There we go. So we're gonna make this shape. So first thing is I'm gonna make this tower here. So I'm gonna sketch a rectangle. So I go to the sketch tool, rectangle. Now if you notice when I come down here it says click on grid, sketch, or solid face to start sketching. So I'm gonna click on this grid. That's gonna allow me to now have my little uh, pointer here. Let's me know where I can sketch. Now I always go to a corner of the dark blue squares. So I'm gonna click, let go. Push my mouse out. Now, that square would be 0.75. So I type 0.75. I'm going to hit enter, 0.75, enter, and then enter. Now I've got this shape right here. I'm going to go up here to construct and I'm going to extrude it. So I'm going to click on this to extrude it. It's going to ask me how high do I want to extrude it. Well, it's one, two blocks high. So I'm going to do, say, two blocks high times 0.75, which if you knew the math, that's also 1.5. Enter. Now I'm going to add, again, why we call additive method, add a sketch to the side of this rectangle. So I'm going to add this piece here. I'm going to start at the corner and go up. It's going to be 0.75, enter, by 1.5 because it's two squares. Enter, enter. I'm going to construct it and extrude it, 0.75. Now I've got this piece. Now I've just got to add this little piece on the end. So I'm going to sketch another rectangle on the end. Here. 0.75, enter, 0.75, enter, enter, extrude, 0.75. So now I've got my shape. What I can do is I can move this shape, and there's all my sketches. Since I don't want them anymore, I'll highlight them and delete them. Now I've got my completed sketch using the additive method.